For businesses with employees spread out across different locations, securely accessing shared resources can be a challenge. In this video, we'll show you how to set up a site-to-site -site VPN tunnel using two Synology routers so that users can transfer files at up to 650 megabits per second without the need to configure VPN settings on individual devices. Ensure your system is running Synology Router Manager 1.1.5 and above and VPN Plus Server version 1.2.0 or higher. Log into the SRM of the router you wish to use at the local site. Open VPN Plus Server and select the Site to Site. Each Synology router used in a Site to Site VPN network requires a license, with users able to obtain a 30 day free trial for each device. Enter the profile name and shared key you wish to use on both sites in the VPN network. Enter the IP address. ID and subnet details for both local and remote sites. To prevent a lost connection, ensure that the local and remote sites are located in separate private subnets. You can alter encryption settings depending on your requirements. However, the settings on both the local and remote sites must be the same. You can download the profile created in the local site's SRM for use in VPN Plus server on the remote site by clicking Export Profile. By exporting a profile, users can directly import a site-to-site -site VPN connection's details into the remote site's SRM. To complete the setup, log into the remote site's SRM. Open VPN Plus Server and either manually enter or import the local site's VPN profile. It is advised that users import the local site's profile as this ensures there are no errors between the profiles in the remote and local sites. To learn more about VPN Plus Server's many other advanced but easy to use remote access solutions, including SSL, VPN, WebVPN, SSTP, and management features that can help business IT monitor and control employees' VPN usage, visit the link in the description.